Hi, my name is Niall Gannon. And I'm the founder of the Gannon Group in St. Louis, Missouri. We conducted this research and built this firm because wealthy investors have been demanding a wealth management model that addressed the specific differences between wealthy investors and non-taxable corporate entities. They wanted something that would be understandable to their family over the generations while honoring the spirit of the entrepreneur that created it. The status quo on Wall Street has gotten it wrong for these investors because they have ignored the impact that taxes, fees, and family cash flows have on the portfolio. We answered this charge by being the first to calculate the after-tax return of the S&P 500, include the effect of state taxation, and then make actionable decision points for building and maintaining an optimal portfolio. We truly believe that shareholder returns over time are a function of the price you pay and the underlying earnings of those companies. We think that's a better indicator going forward of future returns than watching daily swings in the equity markets. Many investors use the P-E ratio to value businesses. We use the inverse of that, which is the earnings yield. The reason we do that is so that you can compare the yield on bonds to the yield on stocks. It, it, it becomes more visibly clear on value of asset classes. Writing investing strategies for the high net worth investor was a rewarding experience because it forced us to go on the public record about our wealth management process. The updated model research reveals the strong correlation of the earnings yield to subsequent 20-year after-tax stock returns. It also highlights the periods in history where bond returns have outperformed after-tax stock returns. The model confirms that asset prices are not random and there are visible signposts available to investors that will guide them before they invest their first dollar. It forced us to go deep into studying the drivers of performance, things that create wealth, but also the things that destroy wealth, whether it's optimistic return expectations, overspending, leverage, taxes, or risk. While investment results are certainly important, it's actually the singular needs of each client family that drives our process. Every family is different. They have different needs at different times. And my team knows that the portfolio that we build for them will ultimately translate into tangible things for these families, living a comfortable retirement, making a meaningful philanthropic impact, or creating opportunities for family members and the next generation. One of the most important aspects of what we do for clients is create cash flow. The cash flow is what funds the lifestyle of our clients. It's what keeps them from liquidating in panics. It's what keeps them living the lifestyle they need to live no matter what's going on or what kind of volatility is happening in any asset market. Asset management cannot be effectively done for families like this in a vacuum. For us to be successful with a 25 or 50 year plan, we must understand the nuances of their tax returns, the governing trust documents, the wills, the insurance documents, and especially their charitable intent. Because we work exclusively with high net worth investors, we have the expertise, but we've developed and are always refining the tools necessary to build portfolios that will achieve their objectives while managing risk. We know that it's about more than just the money. We must understand how the wealth will fit into the lives of our clients. And because we take the time to understand their hopes and dreams, we give them the peace of mind to enjoy the life that they deserve. It's the most gratifying part of our job.